great matchup of two teams, a great atmosphere. It's time for football. Thanks for joining us. Well, we've had quite a year so far with some incredible individual performances, and we're just about ready to get this one started as the Buccaneers square off against the home team. They're lined up for the kickoff, so let's get this game started. Reed is just about ready to kick this one away. This one is handled by Turner. The offense heads out onto the field for the first time. The first and ten. will start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and ten. Do something, do something. Hey, watch that screen. Let's go, boys. It off to the back. Number 29 stops the play in the backfield and he chases him down behind the line of scrimmage for a loss. I'll tell you, he's one of the most knowledgeable defenders in the league. He knows how to play the game and he always knows what's going on. Fall on their own 18. The home team come out in a 4 3. Gets the pass off. Broken up. He felt the pressure and got rid of the ball. That's what the defense has been talking about. Make this guy throw it before he's ready. It's just that little split second early that can cause an incomplete pass or even an interception. Third and 12. Ball on the 18 yard line. From the gun. It's showtime, brother. Not here. Not here. They're blitzing. Gets rid of it. No one near his receiver. Plummer makes the stop, and they'll be short of the marker. He gets the pass to his receiver, who will come up just short of the first down. You're never sure why a quarterback chooses that pass instead of one deeper downfield on that third down situation. Knight sets up to run back the punt. Fair catch. Fair catch made at the 27 yard line. They'll all on their the own 27. At the 27 yard line. First and 10. The Buccaneers come out in a nickel package. Let's go now. Get it up. They give it to the halfback. Atkinson is there on the stop at the 42. The veteran with a good game. He's taken his share of licks over the year. And hasn't stopped him from busting off long gamers like that every now and then. First and ten. Ball on the 42 yard line. No stop, no stop that motor. The Bucks line up in a 4-3. Here we come. It's the toss to the left. Blair is there for the tackle at the 42-yard line. He likes to run in behind his blockers and then make a cut off their hip for a big game. But that strategy didn't work here. It's second down and 10 to go. Number 20, the lone back. Aldridge in motion. it off to the back. Blair is there on the stop at the 46. Number 20. Rumbles forward for a gain of four. Third and six. Ball on the 46-yard line. You gotta have it, deep. Here we go. I can do it, man. Let's go. Going deep. It's broken up. The quarterback did a great job at getting some air under that back. Hitting his guy right in the hand. It just looked like he might have lost a little focus as he tried to bring that pass in. Right. 
Reed comes into the game for the punt. Turner looks like he's ready for the return. He's waving for the fair catch. Fair catch made at the 12 yard line. Deep in their own territory. Start the drive at the 12 yard line. First and 10. Wallace in the backfield. Harris goes in motion. Let's go, Mark. What's green? Hand off to the tailback. Hendrickson is there for the tackle at the 18-yard line. As a coach, you need to make sure that you establish your running game as a weapon that can hurt the other team. Second and four. Ball on the 18-yard line. It's still time, baby. The home team line up in a 4-3. Dropping back. Gets rid of it. And he slips out of bounds at the 22-yard line. Look here. He does two things perfectly on this play. One, he watches the ball all the way into his hands to make the catch. And two, he shows great awareness and gets both feet down in bounds. Hey, that's a nice-looking play. out of bounds at the 31 yard line Wallace fighting for yardage that time he's able to reel off a nice game ball on their own 31 everything you got only one man in the backfield running with purpose number 47 is there on the stop at the 33 yard line Mixon runs with passes, keeps the defense on. Just about a three-yard game. Ball on their own 33. They man. Nickelback in this time. Liner sends a man in motion. Dropping back. Gets the pass off. And he throws incomplete because he had major pressure. The corner came on a blitz and he sprinted for the quarterback. Guys love the opportunity to get a sack. And that time he just missed taking him down. Third and seven. Ball on the 33 yard line. Only one man back. Gets rid of it. And he hits his target. Pass is caught, but just shy of the first down. That was perfect defense. They allowed the catch, but they were there to make the tackle. Nystrom is ready to pump this one away. Knight is the deep return man. And he waves for the fair catch. Ball on their own 21. The Buccaneers come out in a 4-3. Throws it right on target to the wide receiver. Smith is the injured player on the field. He'll be coming out for this next play, so we'll find out what the story is. Ball on their own 35. Ball on the 35-yard line. Let's go, let's go. We're coming to the left. Give me ball. All day, baby. Come on. This side, this side. Left, left. There's a flat going. Away the counter play. May comes up to make the play at the 38. Number 20 runs it for about three on the counter play. Second and seven. 
Give it to the halfback. Number 95 is there on the stop at the 43. Number 20 with a nice burst through the middle that time. Five yard pickup. Third and two coming up here on the 43 yard line. He gets the carry, keeps his feet moving, leaving, stops him short of the marker. Not getting the first down, that will probably bring out the punter. Reed will come in now to punt it away. Turner lines up deep for the punt return. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. Deep in their own territory. So an update now on the injury. It doesn't appear to be anything serious, and his return is probable. Harris, the motion man. For the counter play. Warren is there on the stop at the 15 yard line. Wallace runs it for about three on the counter play. Ball on their own 15. Here we go, baby. They'll go from the I formation. Looking for room. Gets the pass off. Incomplete pass. It'll be third down if we fail to complete that short attempt. Smith returns after spending time on the sideline with an injury. Dropping back. Throws it. Going behind and caught. Plummer brings him down at the 34-yard line. Now that's a quick release. The quarterback decided where he wanted to go with it, and boom, it was in the receiver's hand. Ball on their own 34. Watch a man. The home team come out in a nickel package. No pass on first down. With the throw, number 29 comes up to make the play at the 37-yard line. Watch this hit. He gets his helmet right under his chin, and wham, he takes him straight to the turf. It's third down, two to go. Ball on the 43-yard line. No stop, no stop that motor. The home team with a four-man front. Passing here on third and short. Throws this one away. He didn't want to risk an interception and decides to throw it away. Nystrom comes into the game for the punt. Knight sets up, waiting for the punt. This one goes out of bounds. Ball on their own 34. The Bucks come out in a 4-3. Well play. Bryant stops him for negative yardage. And they lose a few yards on the draw. There was nowhere to go. 
defensive line looked like they knew exactly where that play was headed right from the start. Ball on their own 33. Ball on the 33 yard line. At the end of one, the game is scoreless. And we're ready to start the second quarter. It's second down and a long way to go. The Buccaneers line up in a 4-3. Launches this one to the left. Incomplete pass. There's not one wide receiver who can ever play when he's never dropped a pass. It's just part of the game. The Bucks come out on a nickel package. Play deeper than deeper. Dropping back. Throwing. They'll knock him out of bounds at the 45 yard line. That was a good adjustment by the receiver as he reads the man coverage and finds open space. The thing with these option routes is everyone has to make their read quickly and make their adjustments quickly. Running option routes and running them effectively takes a lot of repetition and practice. The Buccaneers line up in a 4 3. It's the toss to the left. Dropped in the backfield for a short loss. That was a lack of execution from the offense. When the plan is to take it to the outside around the corner, you need to pick up some key blocks. It's second down and a long way to go. Watch your man. Let's go, let's go. They line up in the I formation. Throws it. And the catch is made. Blair is there for the tackle at the 48-yard line. He found a soft spot in the coverage, John. The receiver did a great job reading the coverage. He found a hole in the zone, and the quarterback found him in that hole with the pass. Third down. To convert, they have to get it to the 45-yard line. The Buccaneers line up in a 4-3. So with the pass play on third and short, gets the pass off, and he makes the grab. McDaniels takes him down at the 43. play of this drive. Clear! Clear! Everything you got! Well, it's the lone back. We're talking about Rhea! Uh -oh. And it off. Atkinson comes up to make the play at the 23-yard line. And he was able to create a lot of space on that run, John. Well, it started with some good blocking. And when he got through there, he turned up field, and they weren't in position to tackle him. And this is the ninth play of this drive. They'll go from the I formation. Crossplay to the right. Conway is there for the tackle at the 24. That was just a case of the defense getting off their blocks and flowing with the play. The ball carrier has to read his blocks a little better, find the hole a little more quickly, then look for some cutback opportunity. Ball on the 24 yard line. Smith starts out of the shotgun. Floats one into the end zone. He has it. Touchdown, home team. They put up six points by feeding the coverage. Well, the cover two works well because it eliminates options. At that time, the quarterback made a quick read, and he got it off quickly.
Graham comes in for the extra point. The extra point attempt is good. They have a one touchdown lead now. Looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. This one is taken by Turner. The offense takes over after they were unable to get any points on their last drive. The ball on their own 20 will start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. The home team line up in a 4-3. It's the toss to the left. Bummer comes up to make the play at the 20-yard line. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. Ball on their own 20. The home team come out in a 4-3. Rowan drops the interception. Number eight was his intended target. Number 47 was there on the cover. Defense! 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 So as they get sent to try to convert, here's what both teams have done on third down. The home team come out in a nickel package. Pressure coming with the pass. Complete. You know, when it's third and so many yards, why the heck would you run a pass pattern that was short of the first? Makes no sense to me. Yeah. Offense couldn't get it done in the lineup to punt. From the 32. Knight returns this one to the 40. Number 20 is the deep back. Pump face gets rid of it. And he goes out at the 49-yard line. They completed the pass for a first down. And they did it against the cover, too. So the quarterback found a soft spot, and he got it in there. First Ball right around midfield. Ball on the 49-yard line. The Bucks line up in a 4-3. Let's go, boys! They'll pass on a first down. Gets the pass off, and it's caught. The 30. Atkinson comes up to make the play. They throw it and pick up a second consecutive first down. Well, when you start to establish something, you want to keep it going until the defense finds a way to stop you. So they have first and 10 here. They'll make this a two-possession game if they get into the end zone on this drive. They're just inside the 20. Touchdown, home team. This is a good play by the offense in the red zone. The wide receiver is going to break away right here and come up with a catch and the touchdown. Attempt is good. Now they've put it together offensively with 14 unanswered points. And they can do this sort of thing. Everyone gets on the same page and they'll put up points in bunches.
Reed is back and ready to put this one in the air. This one is handled by Turner. Their last drive ended with a three and out as the offense comes out onto the field again. Ball on their own 20. First and 10. The home team with a four-man front. Warren is there on the stop at the 22-yard line. The defense is trying to shut down the running game early to force him to pass. We'll have to see if it works and causes him to give up on it here in the first half. Fall on their own 22. The home team come out in the 4-3. Pressure with the pass. It's batted away. Great position and great reaction made that play happen. Number 47 with the coverage. Third and eight. Ball on the 22 yard line. Get pressure on man. Number one with the throw. Through to the wide receiver, and he'll take it out of bounds. At the 29, Wade looks to be shaken up after that play, and we'll get you a report from the sideline when we get the information. Knight will go back to accept this punt. Signals for the fair catch. Fair catch made at the 32 yard line. Two minute warning coming up. The injury sustained earlier was minor, and they expect him to return to the game after a series or two. Here they come. Gets rid of it. He hits his receiver. Atkinson is there on the stop at the 48. And a flag down on that play. Let's see what's the ball. Base mask on the defense. Number 25. The team with the most discipline is a team that doesn't commit stupid penalty. And they're the team that usually executes better. to go. The goal from the I formation. Hand it off. Curtis. Conway comes up to make the play at the 29-yard line. You never know when you're going to find some room and break loose into the secondary. Second and a deuce. Ball on the 29-yard line. The Buccaneers come out in a 4-3. Slips the tackle. Ellis is there for the tackle at the 17-yard line. Number 20 pushing his way through the would-be tacklers. He picks up solid yardage. Wade was taken out earlier with a minor injury, but now returns to the game. They don't get nothing. Got it into the end zone on their last red zone drive. Cody, they wind up in reverse that time. Good push in the middle of the line. Yeah, it doesn't matter who you are. If the defense gets that much penetration, you're going to go backward. Inside the red zone. Ball on the 19-yard line. So with the ball in the red zone, they have a very good chance of extending that lead. To the end zone. Almost as a drop in the end zone, so the offense still has possession. And that's the last thing you want as a defender, to have the ball go right through your hands in the end zone. Third and 13. Ball on the 19-yard line. Do some, do some. Only one man back. With the throw, broken up. That's just great positioning by the defender. He has his eyes in the backfield the whole time, 
And he was right there to break the play up. Haley was the one they were trying to get the ball to. This officially will be a 37-yard attempt. The veteran gets the goal. And with that right there, they've now scored 17 unanswered points. They just can't seem to stop them. Comes in to kick off. He got all of it. The, the Buccaneers have their work cut out for them as they take over at the 20-yard line. If they don't want to go into the half down by this much, they're going to need some good throws and good clock management here. First Just over a minute still to go. The home team come out in a nickel package. Fakes the throw. Under pressure with the pass. Good timing. Getting in between the ball and the receiver to save what would have been a big game. Second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Let's go. The home team come out in a nickel package. Closing in, throwing, broken up. He needs to do a better job putting the pass on the spot where only his guy can get it. Those tip passes can turn into interceptions pretty easily. Russell was the intended receiver on that play. Third and ten. Ball and 20 yard line. Here we go, baby. This team has to start converting on third down if they're going to be successful. Fires this one deep. He's there for the count. The 20, the 10, touchdown, Tampa Bay. When you get this kind of execution, you got a great chance of making a big play. Watch it here as everyone takes care of their assignment. The pass is thrown where the receiver can make the best play in the ball, and it's six points. The extra point attempt is good. Football is all about trusting your teammates to make good decisions out there in the heat of the battle. When you can do that, everybody starts firing on all cylinders, and you can come up with drives like the one we just saw. Maestro is just about ready to kick this one away. He got all of that one. He won't have a chance to return here. They turned their last possession into three points. Let's see what they do with the ball this time around. Ball on their own 20. Let's go, let's go. Stay both now. Dime back into this play. Going to the air on first down. Pumps once. Gets the pass off. Can't bring him down. Great throw to beat the zone. I tell you, the defense has to do a better job of coming up and clamping down on the receiver whenever he enters their zone. First and ten. Ball on the 31 yard line. The Buccaneers come out in a 4 3. Pass play here on first down. Pressure coming with the pass. And he makes the grab. Runs through the tackle. May is there on the stop at the 34-yard line. They get another first down here. Well, they're not doing anything fancy, but good old-fashioned drop back to pass. And it's working. Ball on the 34-yard line. Ball on the 34-yard line. 
Number 20, the lone back. Going to the air on first down. Throws it, and he hits his target. John has proven he's a consistent target. Yeah, especially in situations where they're looking to get first down yardage. They're inside the 20. Smith stops the clock there. This will be a 38-yard field goal attempt. The veteran connecting for the field goal. And give credit to the kicker there. It's nice to have a guy that can make your drive worth three, even if you don't get it in the end zone every time. Reed is back and ready to put this one in the air. Scrub kick. the 21 yard line and this should be the last play of the half the home team line up in a 4-3 pump face Long throw. Incomplete pass. It's the end of the second quarter with the score. The home team ahead of the Bucks 27. Nystrom comes in to kick off. This one is taken by Knight. The home team will start this drive from the 20 yard line. So we have first and 10 here. Number 20, the lone setback. Dawkins comes in motion. Looking for room. Spins away from the tackle. The 30. Ellis is there for the tackle at the 47-yard line. This guy always gives maximum effort on every play. It doesn't matter if you're asking him to run between the tackles or outside. He just takes the ball and refuses to be brought down by the tackle. First and 10. The Buccaneers come out in a 4-3. Hey, he gets the count. Yeah. Bryant comes up to make the play at the 48. Cody the best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. you got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. It's second down and five to go. On the 48 yard. They'll bring the blitz. Fires this one deep. This pass is incomplete. Blair delivering the blow on that pass it would have been a lot of yardage if the receiver hung on. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. Smith will work out of the shotgun. Gets the handoff on the delay. So we should see the punter actually fail to convert on third down. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. Reed 
is ready to pump this one away. Turner is back to receive this kick. He's waving for the fair catch. If they want to make this a game, they have to buckle down, avoid mistakes, and work hard to dig themselves out of this hole. Ball on their own five. Watch him in. Wallace, the lone back. Here we go. He'll pass on first down. Gets the pass off. Nearly intercepted. And that was his intended target. Plop had the coverage on the ball. Second it off to the back. Willis is there on the stop at the 11 yard line. Wallace finds some room after taking the handoff, and it looks like about a five yard pickup. Third and five. Number 49 lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Pressure, throwing it away. He couldn't find a receiver, so he threw it where no one could get it. Nothing happening for the offense. They're forced into a three and out. And he waves for the fair catch. Fair catch made at the 46 yard line. First Ball on their own 46. Ball on the 46 yard line. Here we go, baby. Here we go. Number 20, the long back. Rosen behind, but he has it. Blair is there for the tackle at the 42. Bryant appears to have sustained an injury and will make his way to the sideline under his own power. So after that nice catch and run, here's a look at his stats. The Buccaneers with a four-man front. Off to the tailback, Conway comes up to make the play at the 41-yard line. This team's always trying to get a good mix of run and pass plays. Two-yard game. It's second down and nine to go. In regard to the injury, they have decided to keep him on the sideline at least for now, and his return appears to be doubtful. On the delay. Misses the down. They're going to spot this one at the 35. He wraps him up and now has four tackles. Third down play upcoming to convert. They have to get it to the 32. The Buccaneers line up in a 4-3. Hand it off to the back. They'll go with a play fake. Pump fakes. Gets rid of it. He didn't want to risk an interception and decides to throw it away. Graham will have to get all of this one. The kick is long enough and good. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one.
He got all of it, and it sails out of the end zone. This team is going to have to focus a lot more than they did in the first half if they're going to come back. It's first and ten. Direction. Wall comes up to make the play at the 27 yard line. You can't have a good running attack without blocking, but blocking alone won't get you what you need. You got to have a back who can find the holes when they're there. Second and three. Ball on the 27 yard line. Yeah, you see me. Here I go. The home team with a four man front. Under the counter play. Plummer is there on the stop at the 34. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. First and ten. Ball of the 34 yard line. The home team come out of the nickel package. The rush is on. Gets rid of it. Wide receiver has it. Warren Russell is there for the tackle at the 39. Beat the blitz. Decent game. He never seems to rush back there in the pocket. He takes his time, finds his man, and puts it right on the money. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 39-yard line. The home team line up in a 4-3. Hand it off to the back. Plummer comes up to make the play. Wallace has gained enough for another first down, his second of the drive. First Ball on their own 47. Ball of the, the home team come out in a 4 3. Number 97 is there for the tackle. Wallace takes advantage of a little daylight. Picks up three yards. Ball right around midfield. The home team line up in a 4 3. Hand it off to the back. Hendrickson comes up to make the play at the 47. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. Looking for a third down conversion here. They have to get it to the 43. Drops back with the throw. Wall is there for the tackle at the 35. Yeah, he has such a quick release, and the ball is out before anybody knows what's happening. And that makes it hard for him to be sacked, and it gives the defenders less time to react. First ball on the 35-yard line. Ball on the 35-yard line. With the pass. Almost picked off. Wallace was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Wade, who's there on the cover? Ninth play of this drive. Ball on the 35 yard line. Come on! Go away! The home team line up in a 4 3. Plummer comes up to make the play at the 29. Wallace runs it through the middle again of about six. Third down here as they try to get it inside the 25 yard line to convert. Liner out of the gun. Harris comes in motion. Stepping up, throwing, and the catch is made. The completion does not let enough for the first down, so it looks like they'll send in their field goal unit. They'll line up for the kick, and it should be about a 43-yard attempt. 
They were able to pick up a few first downs there to give their kicker a chance. And he was able to do the rest to make it an effective drive. Meister will be kicking off. This one is taken by Knight. They're ready to go again after that last drive ended with a field goal. They'll take over at the 20 yard line. First and 10. They've been solid running the ball on first down, John. Yeah, when you gain five yards or more, it sets you up in good second and third situations. Gets the delayed handoff. Levy is there for the tackle at the 24-yard line. Number 20 at the delayed handoff and gains about three. Ball on their own 24. Ball on the 24-yard line. The Bucks with a four-man front. May is there on the stop at the 37. Number 20 is having an outstanding day with over 100 yards rushing. First and 10. Ball on the 37-yard line. Only one man back. It off to the back. And this one will be spotted at the 48 yard line. He makes his fifth stop of the game on that play. Well, here's a look at his numbers after a nice run, and you can see he's been able to break some tackles. Sends a man in motion. Hand it off. Conway comes over to make the play at the 43. Number 20 with a nice burst through the middle that time. Five yard pickup. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the home team ahead of the Bucks 23. The 10. The, the teams are set for the, the fourth quarter of play. Second and five. Ball on the 43 yard line. The Buccaneers with a four man front. Looking for the long completion down the left side. He was tipped. It's the old adage speed kill. So does Brock with the ball. Tailback, Shed Atkinson comes out to make the play. They brought some extra people but couldn't stop him before he got the first. And run blitzing these guys isn't a bad idea because you know they like to run. You got to be sure to bring guys in the right place. If you think they might run to the outside, additional blitzers in the middle isn't going to help you much. The Buccaneers come out in a 4-3. Pump fakes with the throw, knocked away. That's just the kind of play they've come to expect from him. He always seems to make the big play just when they need him to. Cameron was the intended receiver on that play. And this is the eighth play of this drive. The Bucks with a four-man front. Gets rid of it. He finds his man. They're going to spot this one right at the 27-yard line. He's in on that stop. It's credited with tackle number six. Aldridge with a decent six-yard game. 
It's third down, and they have to get it to the 23 to convert. They line up in the eye formation. Dawkins comes in motion. They watch the screen. it off to the back. Great move to get free. The 10. May comes up to make the play. At the 4. That will keep the chains moving. Yeah, that makes two times in this drive they've given up the first down on third down. As a defensive coordinator, giving up those types of yards will drive you absolutely nuts. First it's first and goal, and goal at the four-yard line. Let's go, let's go! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go! Let's go. Let's go. He'll sneak it. So they'll touch him down at the three. That was actually designed for the quarterback to run, and that's just what he did. Three yards will get them six points. Looking for the goal line. Setting up play action. So a fly to the end zone. Touchdown, home team. This is exactly how you execute the play pack. The quarterback does a great job of selling the run. And that freezes the defense long enough for his receiver to get open in the end zone for the score. attempt is good and their lead here in the fourth quarter is now 20 after getting into the end zone back and ready to put this one in the air. That one is out of the end zone. But they need one quick score the and then some more. First and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. The home team with a four-man front. Willis comes up to make the play. Wallace kept his legs moving. Gets seven hard-earned yards. Ball on their own 27. The home team come out in a nickel pack with the throw. Not the way. What happened there was they got in the throwing list. When you're rushing the quarterback, you caught if you don't get to him in time, get your hands up and try and knock it down just like that. Third and three. Ball on the 27 yard line. Bring it up, bring it up. The home team come out in a nickel package. Drops back. Gets the pass off. Jumps up and comes down with it. This is a guy who comes to play. And he seems to make big catches when they really need him. This time they needed to convert on third down. And he's there for the reception and the first down. Six-yard line. Good job knifing in there to bring him down. He brings a lot of things to the table. But the thing I like the most is how prepared he always is. I mean, he can run and he can tackle. And he watches so much tape that he actually anticipates what the offense is going to run before they call the play. From the gun. Growing. Ooh, nearly picked off. Wallace was his intended target. Number 29 with the coverage.
And here's what they've been able to do so far on third down. The lineup of six defensive backs. Liner sends a man in motion. Under pressure, sack. Big man gets in there for a big sack. He's got a great combination of size and move. Now, he won't be winning any races. He's good at getting after the quarterback. And let me tell you, you never want him to be the guy falling on top of you. Turn. And he chooses not to return this one. First and ten. Ball on the 30 yard line. Nickelback in this time. Hands it off to the fullback. Ooh, what a stiff one. Atkinson comes up to make the play at the 37 yard line. Holder on the offense, number 89. Aldridge is going to be flagged for holding on that play. If the defensive guys get a good jump, sometimes the only thing you can do to protect a quarterback is grab hold of somebody's jersey. So it'll be first and long here after the penalty. Number 20, the lone back. Smith sends a man in motion. With the pass, someone gets a hand up and it drops to the ground. Haley was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Avery had the coverage on the play. Second and long. Ball on the 24 yard line. Blue game, blue game. I love it. Haley comes in motion. Hey, like the move, like the swap. Gets the pass off. He finds his man. Cody Smith completes the short one. About a four yard gain on second down. Number 38 is there for the tackle at the 37. Well, that didn't cut it. Now they're looking at fourth down. And they made the decision to just keep it on the ground. Take time off the clock, not force anything. This is a luxury of being ahead. Turner sets up to run back the punt. Fair catch. Dirt gets made at the 16 yard line. The ball on their own 16. will start the drive at the 16 yard line. First and 10. Liner from the shotgun. Going to the air on first down. Closing in. The pass is picked off. Keeping him at bay. Hendrickson takes it back to the 12. So they have 12 yards to go for a touchdown. Here we go. Let's go, man. Let's go. With the carry. Setting up play action. Gets rid of it. Someone gets a hand up and it drops to the ground. Have a look at this big defensive lineman. He couldn't get to the quarterback, so he got his hands up and he knocked it down. Aldridge moves in motion. Off lob to the end zone. Hale was the intended receiver on that play. Third and ten. Here we go. Don't stop. Don't stop that motor. 
They'll go with the quarter defense. On the carry. Touchdown, home team. He pokes his way through the middle of that line. He's able to run straight ahead into the end zone. Watch it here. The blockers create a creep. He finds it, and he's through it on his way to six. Team four and on with another score. Reed looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. Booming kick downfield. He got all of it, and it sails out of the end zone. It sure doesn't look like they're going to be able to come back in this one, but it's an issue of pride. They want to prove that they're better than they've played so far. Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. Doofy, doofy. Play here on first down. Pressure coming. Steps up. Gets rid of it. The pass was incomplete. He had to unload that pass in a hurry. Yeah, he felt those guys closing in and gunned the ball out of there. Second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Let's turn it up, D. Here it comes. Liner back in the shotgun. With the pass. Drops the interception. That was his intended target. Number 29. It was there on the curve. Third and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. The home team come out of the quarter defense. From the start, from the start. Take deep for the deep. Here they come. Pressure rolling out to his right. He hits his receiver. This is what they have to do. Keep making completions down the field and move the chains. Watch this one. He knows he's got to get the first, and he picks the right guy to throw it to. Number eight he helped his yards after right. catch average go up on that last play. Under pressure with the pass, jumps and makes the catch. When you're a receiver and a pass goes over your head like that, you got to get up there, pull the ball in, and tuck it in before you get hit. Almost at the two-minute mark now. On the 37-yard line. We're talking about Reed. Here we go. Liner out of the gun. Gets the pass off. And he hits his target. The defender brings him down at the 45-yard line. That's a half dozen tackles now. the two-minute mark on the 45-yard line. Watch him, man. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 
Throws it. Wade comes up to make the play at the 26. And they're going without a huddle. Pass play here on first down with the throw. Right on target to the wide receiver. Harris is the injured player on the field. He'll be coming out for this next play, so we'll find out what the story is. Eighth play of this drive. They're threatening inside the 20. Liner from the shotgun. With the pass. Wall is there on the stop. At the three. The quarterback is calling them back to the line of scrimmage. Goes to the end zone. And he can't hang it. Russell drops the pass in the end zone. Good play call. John just couldn't bring it in. It looked like a sure touchdown. He's been struggling recently with his consistency making catches. And when a quarterback can find you in the end zone and hit you in the hand, you got to come up with it. The injury sustained earlier was minor, and they expect him to return to the game after a series or two. To the end zone. He was tipped. And time is working against them. Yeah, I'm thinking they're going to keep going to the end. But it might be a little too late. Harris is back in there after getting taken out with an injury earlier. The home team come out of the quarter defense. They're blitzing. Lops one into the end zone. Touchdown. Johnny didn't let the pressure phase him. What a play. I'll tell you one thing. It was an all or nothing play for the defense. They knew if they didn't get there, they could be in trouble in the secondary. Stevens comes in to attempt the point after. The extra, the extra point, point attempt, attempt is good. good. The Buccaneers still find themselves in a very deep hole. They're going to need a lot of luck to even have a chance at coming back in this one. to get the ball back quickly so they're going to try the onside kick here it is from the 41 yard line they just need to eat up clock now because they have this game pretty well in hand first and 10 ball on the 35 yard line the Buccaneers line up in a 4-3 with the counter play, Conway is there for the tackle. Number 20. Very really little help up front. Maybe a yard or two on the play. Second and eight. Ball on the 33 yard line. The Bucks come out in the 4 3. Gets the call. Conway comes up to make the play. At the 24, number 20 has been a solid runner for them all year long. He's now over the 1,000-yard mark. First and 10, ball on the 24-yard line. Let's go! All that came off. Levy is there on the stop at the 21-yard line. Two-yard game. Ball on the 21-yard line. Ball on the 21-yard line. Here we go. I'll come to baby. There we go. This one is handed off. Atkinson is there for the tackle at the 18-yard line. Gain of three. Right. 
The 14 yard line is where they have to go to pick up the first down. Hey, let's go. Let's go. Looking upfield, they'll go with a play fake. With the throw, he can't bring it down in bounds. I think the quarterback just let that one get away. Pratt was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Shane Graham lines up for about a 36 yard field goal attempt. The kick is good. They're now up by 23 following the field goal. He's just about ready to kick this one away. This one is fielded by Turner. With the game pretty much over, let's see if they try a Hail Mary here. So this could be the last play of the game. Play two quarters, two quarters. This is going to do it, barring a defensive foul. This will be the last play of the game. No pass on first down. Pump fakes. Long throw. Knocked away. That's the end of the game. The final score is the home team. For the Buccaneers, 17. This is Al Michaels with John Madden saying goodbye for EA Sports.